Are we saying hello? Yes. <laughs> All right. On your count. Three, two, one. Hello! hello. <laughs> As you may have noticed, we are in a different environment today. Yeah, we decided to move at the perfect time when everyone should be in their homes. We were moving out of our home, <laughs> but we're just gonna crash at my parents' place until we can find a job after all this corona stuff passes over. As college students who've been through the same ordeal as just about everyone else, we're going online, our campus is closed. They canceled our graduation, they canceled well, our projects day. Our commencement ceremony. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we're still graduating. <laughs> this has been a weird year. It has, not the senior year that you would expect, but here you know, we are. It's fun. But that's not what our vlog is about today. No, it is not. We are not going to rant about COVID. No, you can find that elsewhere. <laughs> but what you may have noticed me ranting about if you watched our cooking vlogs is I'm left-handed and that causes some problems. I can totally use my left hand. <laughs> oh, wrong way. Most things are right-handed biased when it matters, which Makes sense. I mean, it's only like about 10% of the population that's left-handed. But that did inspire me to write a story about what it might be like for a non-dominant right hand. I had this idea for quite a while, actually. Back in high school, I was kind of thinking of funny scenarios I could depict uh, from the right hand's perspective. At that point, I wasn't a filmmaker and I wasn't sure what would be the best medium for the story. And so when I went to college and got into filmmaking with this guy, I realized this would be a great way to do it. So I wrote the screenplay. It was, I think, 17 pages. Yes, it was 17 pages and you banged it out in a day, I think. Yeah, because, I mean, these ideas had just been rolling around in my head for a while. Actually, producing it was a whole ordeal. <laughs> Two summers ago, we were here in Bend. We reached out to people who were in the theater business here in town and managed to get back some potential actors. Mm -hmm. And so we emailed all of them and asked if they would be interested and we had some responses and we were really excited about it. We were like, yes, it's gonna happen. It's gonna be awesome. And then scheduling happened. Yeah. Hello. Hello. <laughs> What's up? I just wanted to grab my notebook. Okay. <laughs> my apologies. That's all right. <laughs> I have to cross out the parts that we have now. All right. Okay. Good luck. Have fun. Thank you. <laughs> Don't spend too much money. <laughs> it's not mine. Oh. oh. Not a great philosophy to live by. <laughs> no. Anyways, where were we? We were talking about scheduling. So we basically had the summer to film everything we needed because at the end of the summer, we were going to leave for England to study abroad. Things kept seeming like they were going to work and then falling through. Yep. And eventually the only thing that we could make happen was getting the voiceovers for this. So we had these awesome professional voice actors that came in, gave us their time and their talent, and really just knocked it out of the park for us. In the course of one night, we managed to record all of the voiceover for this film. Yeah. And I think that was like a week before we were going to leave for England. So then we went abroad. <laughs> yeah, we, we recorded all that stuff and then we hightailed it out of the country for, for three semester. months. Yeah. After studying abroad, we came back, had a busy fall, no, spring semester. Yep. And yet we were able to get together some friends. We took five days and basically it was just Delaney and I behind the camera. She yeah. was directing. I was doing lighting and DP. stuff. <laughs> yeah. We were hightailing it. So we were just like picking random weekends that worked for everyone. And thankfully yep. it turned out. Yes. Yeah, so we <laughs> edited it in DaVinci Resolve. We had to speed ramp parts of the interview to make the hands sync up. And it was quite an ordeal to try and edit everything like that. Yeah, and we showed it to our classmates and our professors and they thought it was funny but they said 
It's too long. <laughs> yeah, at this point the film was about nine minutes long. A lot of the stuff was just jokes and it wasn't progressing the story, yeah. unfortunately. Yeah, yeah. But we do have those in a deleted scenes that we will have linked below yes. that you can go check out on our other channel along with the actual film. Yes, because it's finished its film festival run. Yeah, we released it and it made it into two film festivals, believe yeah. it or not. This is super exciting. It made it into the Gateway Film Festival and the Nick McMinnville Mindel. Short Film Festival. Yeah. And we attended both of those screenings along with all the other awesome films there. Looking back on it, this is like our work a year ago mm -hmm. and we've definitely improved yeah. since then. <laughs> and some parts are just like, Ooh, that could be better, but, but you know, it's still so fun. <laughs> people still have fun and it's yeah. still enjoyable to watch. It's found a niche market in left hand. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> so yeah, it's been really fun, but now we're ready to release it to the rest of the world. We've put together a trailer for it mm -hmm. that we want to show you guys. Yeah, so here Enjoy. we go. Enjoy! <laughs> My name is Righty Greg. I am Greg's right hand. Um, non-dominant right hand. All Greg ever does is scorn and blame me when something goes wrong. Oh, guess that's what I get for using my right hand. Hey Greg. I think you should ask her out. It's like I was born into a rich family and immediately disowned. But then Lefty, he came to me and he was like, dude, you got this. This was my opportunity. Hopefully that trailer just sparked some intrigue in you guys. And yeah. Hopefully you actually want to see the full film. It's linked below on our professional channel, Coco Fox Art. Enjoy it. Send it to your friends. Yeah. We just want people to watch it, people to be entertained by it. If you know any lefties out there, send their way. Tell them you're thinking about them. Thanks for watching, guys. Yeah, thanks. Go enjoy the film Bye. and tell us what you think. Yeah. Bye. 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 Oh. <laughs>